good morning, Lunati. It's a beautiful day, and yes, I'm back. Okay, so yes, I have been away long time no see, people. It's been such a oh, weird, weird, weird moment. It's also been a really long, exciting period of time. So many things have been happening, um, including me writing my first book. I'll talk to you about it afterward. Um, it's been a, it's been an amazing time. I've been away. I've been doing so many things, working on so much stuff. Um, you can see the frame of change of frame, hair is shorter, everything's different. The summer's here. It's my birthday in like a few weeks' time. Just want to let you know that. Remember to send me a little shout out for my birthday. Today I want to do a short little video on one of the topics that I have in my book is what do millennial really want from the workplace? So first of all, like. What is a millennial? Are you a millennial? Am I a millennial? If you're the, uh, if you if you are between the age of twenty in the early twenties and thirties, mid mid thirties, you kind of fall under that category of millennial. So millennial are the people just after Generation X, you know, whose parents are baby boomers, um, and they make kind of a whole chunk of the working population at the moment. Three things. Three things I want to talk about that millennials want in a workplace more than anything. And the first thing is, millennials want a reason to go to work every day. They want a reason to feel like this is really good for them. They want a reason where they know that they're, they're going out to, the, they, they're going to work every day and they're in a fulfilled workplace which brings them value, which makes them a sense of purpose, a sense of why they're here, they're bringing something to the table. They feel like, oh my God, you know, this is not just end of a job, it's something that makes my life different and I'm making a difference to someone else's life. That's what a millennial wants. So a millennial wants a fulfillment, reason to do something. The second thing that a millennial wants more than anything is growth. Yes, not just physically in terms of monies and all sorts of things, but they want growth. Growth could come in the, in the sense of having people direct them and guide them into the right direction. So they want bosses who are like mentors and friends, not, you know, not best friends all the time. You know, buddies or drinking buddies, because that's not going to happen. But they want, you know, a mentor kind of figure, someone that's going to kind of direct them. They feel this is the most, imp this is the most important thing. It's a thing that's going to help them grow. So that's kind of what they want. What else do millennials want? They want fle <laughs> flexibility. Stretching. <laughs> they want flexibility. That's what they want. Why flexibility? Because flexibility means I don't have to be at work every day from nine to five. I want to have that flexibility when I'm working from home from time to time. I want to have that flexibility where, yes, I could start at 10 one morning and start at 11 the next day and catch up with my work. And I want to be able to work from a coffee shop. You know, I want flexibility to be able to learn something different because, you know, it's not just about turning up to work. It's not just about to do those kind of things, but it's so much more, you know, the, the term nine to five doesn't even really exist anymore. I mean, most of us know that millennials are here to adapt. They are the most adaptable candidates in the workplace. So if you're watching this today and you're wondering as an employer or as an employee, but most of us an employer and you're wondering, how do I hire a millennial? How do I make a better workplace for them? Just think of those strings. Flexibility, growth, and fulfillment. If you make them feel like they're valued, they have a reason to be there and do something, you're doing the right stuff. Now, that's all I have for today. If you like this video, and if you want to see more of me, I'll be back next week. That's right, I'll be back next week for another episode of Good Morning Matty. What you have to do is just continue this conversation. Put your comment. What do you think? What are the most important reasons for you in the workplace? share it with your friends come back to me on facebook and why not i'll see you guys again next week see you later